Hello guys, welcome back to Critty Boy Update. And if you're joining us for the first time, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell. Like and share this video to all social media platforms. A family has come out to ask for justice after their son donated the family house as a seed to Christ's embassy in Worry Delta State. The abroad-based man, identified simply as Shedrach, is said to have returned to Nigeria last year and became serious with religion to the approval of his family. Last year, he sold his car as a seed to the church and his family members had no problem with it. However, he went on to donate the family house to the church not long ago. His family members were not aware their home had been donated until Shedrach's father noticed men going around viewing the property. When the older man made inquiry, he was told the property now belongs to Christ's embassy and has been valued to be sold at 25 million naira. The house was built on land owned by the entire family and with money contributed by the whole family, though Shedrach contributed the lion's share. The house is occupied by Shedrach's father, cousins and four tenants who paid rent. The father of Shedrach said he has written to the senior pastor of Christ's embassy in Worry and he promised to take action, but a month has passed and nothing has happened. But the shocking thing happening right now is that everyone is blasting at Pastor Chris Oyakilome, the founder of Christ Embassy Church. And I would like to dive into this issue. If this man, Shedrach, truly give the church his house property as a seed, there is nothing wrong in that. But if the church forced him, that is when the whole issue is supposed to be taken to the police station and to the court for justice. Shedrach. When he came back from London, started worshipping with Christ's embassy worry. I was so pleased that my son becomes a Christian. But sometime unknowingly to me, the car he was using, he gave it to the church. When I asked him, he said, uh, he sold the seed with it. Later on, information reached me that even the house, the family house, the family house we are living now with uh, four tenants, my children, and a store, and a store that he has given it as a seed to Christ embassy. We went to the church to see the senior pastor of Worry Branch who promised to hand over the papers to us. Running up to one month now, they have refused to release the hard documents presented by my son, Shedra. We have met this senior pastor who promised to release this document, document of the duty. Do you know the father of Shedra has now lawyered up after reporting to the police? and so has Christ's embassy. In a statement, Shadrach's father pleaded with the general overseer of Christ's embassy, Christo Yakilome, to intervene. And from now, till now, I mean, Christ's embassy's founder, Pastor Christo Yakilome, has not said anything. So guys, we'll be taking some few comments concerning this issue on the ground. Someone commented and say, if you attend Christ's embassy, fall out this morning, let's fight. Your branch in Wari accepted someone's family house papers as seed. Now they have sent the family packing with lawyers and even threatening with lawyers and all. What nonsense is this? Despite please. The guy also said, the guy came from abroad and did this after they have most likely brainwashed him. Now they say they want to sell it to print Rhapsody of Realities. Or more ahead, it is the branch at Mufo. Which kind of wickedness is this? He said. And someone replied him and said, but nothing wrong here. He gave them his papers willingly without a gun put to his head. Maybe he was led by the spirit. So let the new owners do to their property what they wish. And this guy replied, you are foolish, house built on the family land. 
still withhold the documents. We have contacted our lawyer to intervene. Our son used his car to Sochi a year ago and now used the family house to Sochi. The family is opposed to the to it. We like this we see this opportunity to appeal to Pastor Chris to to direct this worrying senior pastor to release the house docu house documents we have we have also reported the matter to the police station.